Hello everyone, Scottish Lad here and welcome back to Scottish Lad Darts channel. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the Unicorn Eclipse Ultra Dartboard. It's $63.95 retail, available from all good retailers. And the thing about this board is it's quite firm. Just from kind of the touch and feeling of it, it definitely, you can tell it's going to be a firm board. And I have threw on a board like the Eclipse Ultra before in the Pub League. Quite a firm board, but it's not as firm as like say the Target Aspar, but it's not as soft as the Windmore Blade 6 either, so it's kind of a good go-between if you like a board with a bit of firmness, but it's not rock solid. But for £63.95 you're getting the Unilock provided as well, which is great. For It's very similar to the Rotolock in terms of how it's going to keep the dart placed on the wall evenly, similar to what the Rotolock does with the Windmore Blade 6. But for £63.95, you're getting a wee bit more for your money, I'd say, because my first impression when I first threw on it was it was a decent board. But now that I've got one, I'll properly test it, so I'll go through a range of different points, a range of different kind of style of darts. And I'll even kind of work my throw a wee bit, so sometimes it's going to be soft, sometimes it's going to be a wee bit too hard to see how it lasts that way. But I've given you enough here, I've given you the price, it, you can get it from pretty much any retailer. Darts Corner, Darts GB, Premier Darts, Bully, Up, eh, Bully Darts, sorry, Bit of Bully Darts. There's all sorts of retailers you can get it if you're abroad, Darts Shopper, places like that you can get this board. But for £63.95, is it worth it? So I'm going to give you some of my first impressions in this video. So stay tuned, watch the rest of the video, and let's crack on with it. Ladies and gentlemen, first impressions, as you can see, the box is very nice looking. It's got a nice graphic on it. It's giving you all the details. For example, the new Ultra 33% Spider. So, less embedded Spider than doubles and trebles for higher scoring and less reject darts in critical areas. Also comes with the Unilock system, which is an innovative bolt locking system. Eliminates wobbling on uneven wall surfaces. So, we'll see if that works when we get to it. Ultra Sizo, upgraded processing and finishing for improved recovery and durability. But enough of that, let's get it open and we'll see what the board looks like. And here we go. The first impressions looking at it, it's a very clean board and I can already see a few imperfections but it's not anything major. So let's have a quick one round the board. And as you can see there's some set wee white dots and stuff on the black. Some dots on the white segments as well. But feeling at it, it feels as if it's going to be quite a firm board already. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. So here we go. We'll go a wee around the board. And as you can see, a few wee minor imperfections. But what that board these days does not have a minor imperfection. But in terms of how it looks, it looks fantastic. It looks very bright as well, but we'll soon see it under the lights. Let's have a look at the bull. Now the bull looks bang on centre, it doesn't look off centre. And then we've got the Eclipse Ultra branding and the HD number ring. Now personally, I really like the look of that number ring. And for the price, will it last long? We shall soon see. But what I'm going to do, folks, is I'm just going to quickly skim around it again. And then I'll get it hung up. And we'll see what it looks like on the wall. So... That's the close-up of the Unicorn Eclipse Ultra, so without me having to do this. So let's go on to the next part where I'll hang it on the wall and we'll chuck some darts at it. Right, ladies and gentlemen, so first impressions of it being on the wall, it looks very, very nice under the LED lights. And as you can see, completely level. First time putting it up, I didn't even need to check it. I always double check anyway and it was bang on. And it would go with the QSO D8 headlight as well. It looks very, very nice. But I've gave you that with the light on. It looks absolutely fantastic. I think it looks stunning. So I'm going to set the phone up. We'll have chucked some darts at it. So let's officially christen the Unicorn Eclipse Ultra Dart Bolt. Well, let's crack on with it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, I've got the Unicorn Eclipse Ultra on the, ball, on the wall. So let's have a couple of visits at it and we'll see how it sounds, how it looks, how it feels with the darts hitting it. 
first impression is, is very, very quiet. Never mind, obviously, that skull there, but it's very, very quiet, which I like. The pressure's on when you get a new build up to try and get the treble 20, so I feel like you're trying too hard to get it. I'm really liking how this sounds when the darts hit it. We'll see how well it heals it. I mean, some of the holes are already pretty much starting to heal up instantaneously, which I like. Oh, I need deflection off the flights. That did not reach the board there, just for reference. So, let's try a couple more. So, I'm getting closer to that treble 20. Definitely a board I'll be using for a wee while just to see how it wears, etc. But so far, I'm really impressed. Right. Now, there's a speculation about the bills that have been hard on this board. So, I'll aim for the 25 and bill and we'll see how they got on there. That aim for the 25 and boom, we'll see how we got on there. <laughs> well, there's two in the 25 there. I'm quite impressed with that. It did feel as if the point was a wee bit loose, but it could just be my points need roughed up. Two. Then I uh, they feel alright on there. So I'm just gonna have one more visit at the twenties and then we'll go get a summary done. Nah, steady six to finish it off with that. Let's go get wrapped up. There we have it folks. That was my quick review of the well, my first impressions, I should say, of the Unicorn Eclipse Ultra. And honestly, it's a very quiet board, I noticed. It seems to be holding up well. Considering it was only a few darts, I know. But I'll have, obviously, this up for the next few reviews. And in between for practice sessions as well. And we'll come back to it and have a better look at how it's lasted. In terms of different points and stuff. But that the points I was using there were the... Yeah, yeah, compact spike. So essentially a smooth silver point, and it was doing pretty well. I mean, there's a few wee holes that haven't quite healed up yet, but the more I throw darts at it, hopefully the more they start to heal up. But first impressions, decent board for the price, I have to say. In terms of the quality, it feels a bit firm. I mean, the darts are getting in, and they're hitting well, but. In terms of firmness, if you're a heavy thrower, you throw quite hard, they're going to work well for you. But if you've got a very, very soft throw and it's very, not very quick, it may not work well for your throw. But like myself, I've got a bit of hard throw, so it does work for me. But that was my first impressions of the Eclipse Ultra anyway. Thanks again to Unicorn for providing it, to be able to do these videos on it and future Unicorn reviews. But thanks everybody for taking the time to watch this quick video. As I say, there will be an update to this once I've actually tested it properly with a few different ranges of darts points, at darts, etc. But thanks everybody for taking the time to watch. Stay safe out there. And of course, keep on darting.